Ever feel a pang of envy watching a chef effortlessly prepare calamari? Their secret? Often, it's the unparalleled quality of Japanese squid. Japan, a nation intertwined with the sea, holds a special mastery over squid fishing, hauling in millions every year. But how do they do it? We're about to dive into the thrilling world of Japanese squid fishing, exploring the ingenuity of their methods and the culinary artistry that transforms this ocean dweller into a delicacy. As the sun dips below the horizon, painting the sky in hues of orange and purple, Japanese squid fishing boats set off. Their target? The elusive squid, creatures of the deep that only rise under the cover of darkness. The fishermen, hardened by years of battling the elements, know the sea like the back of their hands. They understand the squid's habits, their movements guided by the moon's cycle and the ocean's currents. Central to their success is the Japanese trawl net a massive, cone-shaped web specifically designed for squid. Unlike traditional nets that trap fish by their gills, this net uses a more ingenious approach. The net is equipped with bright lights that mimic the bioluminescence of deep-sea creatures, attracting the squid. Drawn to the light, the squid swim into the net's wide mouth, becoming ensnared in its depths. As the net surfaces, it teems with life, a writhing, glistening mass of silver and white. The fishermen spring into action, their movements a well-rehearsed ballet honed by generations of tradition. With practiced hands, they sort the catch, separating the squid from any bycatch, ensuring minimal impact on other marine life. Speed is critical, as the squid must be processed quickly to maintain their freshness. Section 5. From Sea to Shore. A Race Against Time. The race against time continues as the boats return to shore, laden with their precious cargo. The squid, still shimmering with the ocean's iridescence, are immediately transported to nearby processing facilities. Here, skilled workers meticulously clean and prepare the squid, ensuring that only the highest quality reaches the market. Every step, from catching to processing, is imbued with a deep respect for the ocean's bounty. Section 6. The Art of Preparation. Transforming the Catch. Japanese cuisine is renowned for its reverence for fresh ingredients, and squid is no exception. The preparation methods are as diverse as the squid itself, each technique highlighting its unique texture and flavor. From the delicate art of sashimi to the smoky allure of ikamishi, Japanese chefs have elevated squid to an art form. Each dish is a testament to their culinary ingenuity, a harmonious blend of tradition and innovation. Section 7. Sashimi a delicate dance of freshness. Perhaps the most iconic Japanese squid dish is sashimi, a testament to the squid's pristine freshness. This dish is not just about the taste, but also about the art of preparation. The chef's skill in slicing the squid to the perfect thickness is crucial. Each slice must be thin enough to be tender, yet thick enough to hold its shape and texture. Thinly sliced and served raw, sashimi allows the squid's natural sweetness and delicate texture to shine through. The process of preparing sashimi is a meticulous one, requiring a sharp knife and a steady hand. The chef must ensure that each slice is uniform, creating a visually appealing presentation that is as pleasing to the eyes as it is to the palate. Dipped in soy sauce and wasabi, the squid's flavor is enhanced, a symphony of umami that dances on the palate. The combination of the salty soy sauce and the spicy wasabi creates a balance that elevates the natural flavors of the squid. This simple yet sophisticated pairing is a hallmark of Japanese cuisine, where the quality of the ingredients is allowed to shine. It's a dish that speaks volumes about the Japanese culinary philosophy, simplicity that belies its complex flavor profile. The beauty of sashimi lies in its purity. There are no heavy sauces or elaborate cooking techniques to mask the flavor of the squid. Instead, the focus is on the freshness and quality of the ingredients and the skill of the chef in bringing out their best qualities. This delicate dance of freshness is a true testament to the artistry of Japanese cuisine. Section 8. Ika Sugatayaki, the seduction of smoke and sweet. For those who prefer a more robust flavor, Ika Meshi, or grilled squid, is a true delicacy. This dish is a staple in Japanese street food culture, often found sizzling on grills at bustling night markets and festivals. The preparation of Ika Meshi is an art form requiring skill and precision to achieve the perfect balance of flavors and textures. Marinated in a savory sweet sauce and grilled to perfection, the squid takes on a smoky aroma that is simply irresistible. 
The marinade typically consists of soy sauce, mirin, sake, and sugar, which together create a complex flavor profile that enhances the natural taste of the squid. As the squid cooks, the sauce caramelizes, adding a layer of sweetness that complements the smoky undertones. The high heat caramelizes the marinade, creating a beautiful char on the squid's surface, giving it a slightly crispy exterior. This charring process not only adds a delightful crunch, but also intensifies the flavors, making each bite a burst of umami goodness. The flames licking the squid add a touch of drama to the cooking process, making it as visually appealing as it is delicious, while the inside remains tender and juicy. The contrast between the crispy exterior and the soft, succulent interior is what makes ikameshi so special. Each piece is a testament to the chef's expertise, ensuring that the squid is cooked just right, neither too tough nor too soft. Served with a squeeze of lemon, ikameshi is a dish that embodies the perfect balance of sweet, savory, and smoky flavors. The acidity of the lemon cuts through the richness of the marinade, adding a refreshing zest that elevates the overall taste. This simple yet elegant garnish not only enhances the flavor, but also adds a touch of brightness to the presentation, making it a feast for both the eyes and the palate. Whether enjoyed as a street food snack or a main course, ikameshi is a culinary experience that captures the essence of Japanese cuisine. Section 9. Beyond the Plate Squid and Japanese Culture Squid is more than just food in Japan. It's deeply intertwined with the nation's culture and folklore. The cephalopod has been a part of Japanese history for centuries, appearing in various forms of traditional art and storytelling. Ancient scrolls and paintings often depict squid, symbolizing both mystery and the bounty of the sea. From ancient myths to modern festivals, squid holds a prominent place in Japanese art, literature, and even religious ceremonies. Festivals across Japan celebrate the squid, with elaborate floats and performances that honor this fascinating creature. In some regions, squid is even considered a spiritual symbol, representing resilience and adaptability. In coastal communities, squid fishing is a way of life, passed down through generations. The techniques and traditions of squid fishing are taught from a young age, ensuring that the knowledge and skills are preserved. These communities rely heavily on the sea, and squid fishing is a crucial part of their daily lives. It's a source of livelihood, community, and a deep connection to the sea, a testament to the enduring bond between humans and nature. The annual squid festivals in these villages are a time of celebration, where the entire community comes together to honor the sea's gifts. These events feature traditional music, dance, and, of course, an abundance of squid dishes, showcasing the versatility and importance of this marine creature in Japanese culture. Squid is also a culinary staple in Japan, featured in a variety of dishes from sushi to tempura. Chefs take great pride in preparing squid, using techniques that have been refined over generations. The texture and flavor of squid make it a favorite ingredient in Japanese cuisine, and its presence on the dining table is a reflection of its cultural significance. In bustling markets, fresh squid is a common sight, with vendors showcasing their catch of the day. Shoppers carefully select the best squid, knowing that they are not just buying food, but a piece of their cultural heritage. The act of purchasing and preparing squid is a ritual that connects people to their history and traditions. Educational programs in Japan also emphasize the importance of squid, teaching children about marine life and the ecological significance of these creatures. Schools often organize trips to coastal areas where students can learn firsthand about squid fishing and the marine environment. This hands-on experience fosters a deep respect for nature and an understanding of the delicate balance of marine ecosystems. Ultimately, squid is a symbol of continuity and connection in Japanese culture. It brings families together, whether through shared meals or communal celebrations. The story of squid in Japan is one of tradition, community, and a profound respect for the natural world. It is a reminder of the intricate relationship between humans and the sea, and the ways in which culture and nature are inextricably linked. Section 10. A Sustainable Future. Respecting the Ocean's Bounty. As we've journeyed through the world of Japanese squid fishing, we've witnessed the ingenuity, skill, and respect that goes into bringing this delicacy to our plates. But this tradition faces a critical challenge. Sustainability. Overfishing and climate change threaten the delicate balance of our oceans. It's crucial that we support sustainable fishing practices, ensuring that future generations can continue to savor the unique flavors of Japanese squid. Ever looked into the abyssal black eyes of a creature pulled from the ocean's deepest trenches? 
Imagine a beast with tentacles strong enough to crush steel, eyes like dinner plates, and a razor-sharp beak. This is no horror movie monster. This is the giant squid, a delicacy in Japan. Come with me, let's journey to the land of the rising sun where ancient culinary traditions transform this deep sea leviathan into a symphony of flavors. The air is thick with salt and anticipation as the fishing boat returns. The crew, weary yet exhilarated, stands on deck, their eyes scanning the horizon as the familiar outline of the harbor comes into view. Each man is lost in his thoughts, reflecting on the night's labor and the bounty they bring back. The boat cuts through the water with a sense of purpose, a silent testament to the hard work and determination of those aboard. Dawn paints the sky with hues of pink and orange, casting a serene glow over the ocean. The first light of day breaks through the darkness, illuminating the path home. The colors of the sky mirror the emotions of the fishermen, a blend of exhaustion and triumph. As the sun rises it brings with it a new day, a new beginning, and the promise of rest after a long night at sea. The iridescent skin of the prize catch, a giant squid, hauled from the depths, glistens in the early morning light. This creature, a marvel of the deep sea, is a testament to the mysteries that lie beneath the ocean's surface. Its size and beauty are both awe-inspiring and humbling, a reminder of the power and wonder of nature. The fishermen gather around their faces a mix of pride and reverence as they take in the sight of their hard-won prize. Fishermen, weathered by the sea, work with practiced efficiency. Their hands move with a rhythm honed by years of experience, each action deliberate and precise. They know the value of their catch, not just in monetary terms, but in the effort and skill required to bring it aboard. These men, seasoned by countless voyages, understand the delicate balance between man and nature, and they treat their prize with the respect it deserves. Their respect for the creature is evident in every move. They handle the giant squid with care, mindful of its significance. Each touch is gentle, each motion considerate, as if they are aware of the life that once pulsed through its veins. The bond between the fishermen and their catch is palpable, a silent acknowledgement of the struggle and the victory that brought them together. The sheer size of the squid is awe-inspiring, it stretches across the deck, its tentacles sprawling in all directions. The enormity of the creature is a stark contrast to the men who caught it, highlighting the incredible feat they have accomplished. This is not just a catch, it is a conquest, a testament to the strength and perseverance of the fishermen. Tentacles, thick as a man's torso, ride with residual life. The sight is both mesmerizing and unsettling, a reminder of the raw power of the ocean's inhabitants. Each movement is a dance of sinew and muscle, a final display of the creature's might. The fishermen watch in silence, their expressions a mix of fascination and respect for the life they have taken from the sea. The air crackles with the excitement of the catch. Laughter and shouts of triumph fill the air, a release of the tension that has built up over the course of the night. The men celebrate their victory, their camaraderie strengthened by the shared experience. This moment, this feeling of accomplishment, is what drives them to return to the sea time and time again. A hard-won battle against a creature of the deep. The struggle to catch the giant squid was intense, a test of strength and endurance. The fishermen recall the moments of tension, the adrenaline that surged through their veins as they fought to bring the creature aboard. This is the life they have chosen, a life of challenge and reward, of danger and triumph. And as they stand on the deck, the giant squid at their feet, they know that they have earned their place in the annals of the sea. The real magic begins in the kitchen. It's here, amidst the clatter of pots and the hum of activity, that culinary dreams take shape. The kitchen is a realm of transformation where raw ingredients are turned into exquisite dishes that tantalize the senses. The air is thick with the aroma of spices and the sound of sizzling pans, creating a symphony of sensory delights. This is where the journey of taming the kraken begins. Here, master chefs, wielding gleaming knives, approach the squid with reverence. The squid, a formidable creature of the deep, is treated with the utmost respect. The chefs understand the significance of their task. They are not merely preparing a meal, but honoring the life of the creature that once roamed the ocean's depths. Each chef brings their own unique touch to the process, a blend of tradition and innovation. Every movement is precise, every cut deliberate. The chef's hands move with the grace of a dancer, each motion calculated to achieve the perfect result. The knife glides through the squid's flesh with ease, a testament to the chef's skill and experience. This is not just a display of technical prowess, but a demonstration of the deep connection between the chef and their craft. The squid is transformed piece by piece into something new and extraordinary. The creature, once a denizen of the deep, is about to embark on a new journey, a transformation into a culinary masterpiece. The kitchen is a place of alchemy, where the ordinary becomes extraordinary. The squid, now prepared and ready, is the star of the show. It will be cooked with care and precision, each step of the process designed to enhance its natural flavors and textures. The journey from ocean to plate is a testament to the chef's dedication and passion. The squid's skin, slick and shimmering, is carefully peeled away. This is a delicate process, requiring a steady hand and a keen eye. The skin, once a protective barrier, is now removed to reveal the tender flesh beneath. The chef works with patience and precision, ensuring that the squid is prepared to perfection. 
This is a moment of transformation, where the raw becomes refined, and the ordinary becomes extraordinary. The beak, sharp enough to sever bone, is removed. This is a crucial step in the preparation process, as the beak is inedible and must be discarded. The chef handles this task with care, ensuring that the squid is not damaged in the process. The removal of the beak is a symbolic act, representing the taming of the kraken. The once fearsome creature is now ready to be transformed into a culinary delight. The innards are cleaned, each organ meticulously sorted and saved, nothing goes to waste. This is a testament to the chef's respect for the ingredients they work with. Every part of the squid is utilized from the tentacles to the ink sac. The chef's commitment to sustainability and resourcefulness is evident in every step of the process. The squid, once a creature of the deep, is now a symbol of culinary excellence. The journey of taming the kraken is complete, and the result is a dish that is both a feast for the eyes and a delight for the palate. Now comes the true test of the chef's skill, transforming the squid's flesh into sashimi, the pinnacle of Japanese cuisine. With deft hands the chef slices the squid into translucent sheets, each piece a testament to years of training. The sashimi practically glows, its delicate flavor promising a taste of the ocean itself. Dipped in soy sauce and a touch of wasabi, the squid explodes with umami, a savory delight that lingers on the palate. A symphony of textures, from tentacle to fin. But you know the sashimi is only the beginning. The tentacles with their satisfying crunch are perfect for grilling. The fins, tender and flavorful, are ideal for stir-fries. Even the ink, carefully extracted, is a prized ingredient, adding a unique depth to sauces and pastas. The chef, a culinary alchemist, understands the nuances of each part, coaxing out hidden flavors and textures. The air fills with the tantalizing aroma of grilling squid. Tentacles, skewered and brushed with a sweet and savory glaze, sizzle over hot coals. The chef, eyes narrowed in concentration, orchestrates the cooking process, ensuring each piece is cooked to perfection, slightly charred on the outside, tender and juicy within. The aroma is intoxicating, a siren call to hungry diners. The anticipation builds with each passing moment as the squid transforms into a smoky delicacy. Finally, the moment of truth arrives. The kitchen, a bustling symphony of clattering pans and sizzling ingredients, falls into a hushed anticipation. The chef, a maestro in this culinary orchestra, takes a deep breath. Every element of the dish has been meticulously prepared, each component a testament to hours of dedication and skill. The ingredients sourced from the finest purveyors have been transformed through the alchemy of cooking into something extraordinary. Now, it is time to bring it all together. The chef, with the precision of an artist, arranges the dish on a plate. Each movement is deliberate, each placement intentional. The plate is his canvas, and the ingredients are his palate. He begins with the sashimi, laying it down with the care of a jeweler setting precious stones. The fish, sliced to perfection, gleams under the kitchen lights, its freshness evident in its vibrant color and delicate texture. Next. He adds the grilled squid tentacles, their charred edges a contrast to the smooth sashimi. The aroma of the grilled seafood wafts through the air, a tantalizing promise of the flavors to come. Sashimi, gleaming like jewels, sits alongside grilled tentacles, their aroma a promise of savory delights. The juxtaposition of raw and cooked, smooth and charred, creates a visual and sensory harmony. The chef's hands move with practiced ease, adding elements that enhance both the flavor and the presentation. A few delicate microgreens are placed with tweezers, their bright green a pop of color against the more subdued tones of the seafood. Thin slices of radish add a crisp texture and a hint of peppery bite. Each addition is carefully considered, each element contributing to the overall balance of the dish. A sprinkle of sesame seeds, a sprig of parsley and the dish begins to take on its final form. The sesame seeds add a nutty flavor and a slight crunch while the parsley brings a fresh, herbaceous note. The chef steps back for a moment, assessing his work with a critical eye. He knows that the final touches are what will elevate the dish from excellent to extraordinary. He reaches for a small bottle of sauce, the culmination of hours of reduction in seasoning, a drizzle of sauce, the final flourishes on a culinary masterpiece. The sauce, rich and glossy, is applied with a steady hand, its deep color contrasting beautifully with the lighter elements of the dish. It pools around the seafood, adding depth and complexity to each bite. The chef adds a few more finishing touches, a dusting of finely grated citrus zest for a burst of brightness, a few edible flowers for a touch of elegance. Each addition is a stroke in the painting, a note in the symphony. The dish is a feast for the senses, a symphony of colors, textures, and aromas. The vibrant hues of the sashimi and microgreens, the charred edges of the squid, the glossy sauce, all come together to create a visual masterpiece. The textures from the tender sashimi to the slightly chewy squid, the crisp radish to the crunchy sesame seeds, offer a delightful contrast with each bite. The aromas, a blend of fresh seafood, grilled notes, and the fragrant sauce, tantalize the nose and promise a memorable dining experience. It is an homage to the squid, a creature transformed from denizen of the deep, to culinary delight. The chef presents the dish with a sense of pride and accomplishment, knowing that he has honored the ingredients and the traditions of his craft. The journey from ocean to plate has been one of care, skill, and creativity. As the dish is carried out to the dining room, the chef takes a moment to reflect on the artistry of cooking. 
a blend of science and art, tradition and innovation, all coming together to create something truly special. Beyond the Plate, the story of the giant squid in Japan is deeply rooted in the fabric of their culture, mythology and history. From ancient tales of the Kraken to modern-day festivals celebrating the creature, the giant squid holds a unique place in the Japanese psyche. Eating squid, especially the giant squid, is not just a meal, it's an experience. It's a connection to the past, a celebration of the sea, and a testament to the artistry of Japanese cuisine. This, my friends, is what food is all about. It's about more than just sustenance. It's about stories, traditions, and connections. It's about taking something as simple as a squid, and through skill and passion, transforming it into something extraordinary. It's about understanding that food has the power to transport us, to connect us, and to remind us of the beauty and wonder that exists in the world around us. So, the next time you're feeling adventurous, I urge you to step outside your comfort zone. Explore the world of Japanese cuisine, and discover the unique flavors and textures of the giant squid. You might be surprised at what you find. Remember the best meals are often the ones that challenge us, intrigue us and leave us wanting more. This is just a glimpse into the fascinating world of Japanese cuisine. There are countless other dishes, each with its own story to tell. So, go forth, explore, and discover the culinary treasures that await you in the land of the rising sun. Itadakimasu! Sushi, tempura, sashimi, these are not just dishes, they are a celebration of Japanese culinary artistry, each bite a testament to centuries of tradition and meticulous craftsmanship. Ever wonder where that tender, flavorful squid in your favorite Japanese dish comes from? It's not just about the final presentation on your plate, it's about the journey that squid takes from the ocean to your table. It's a journey that starts thousands of miles away, in the vast expanse of the Pacific Ocean. The ocean, with its deep blue waters and endless horizon, is the birthplace of this culinary delight. I've traveled the globe chasing culinary adventures, and let me tell you, few things are as impressive as witnessing Japanese fishermen haul in a massive catch of squid. The excitement, the skill, the sheer hard work involved, it's a sight to behold. These skilled seafarers have been perfecting their craft for centuries, using traditional techniques passed down through generations. Their expertise is evident in every movement, every knot tied, and every net cast. They brave the elements, their boats dwarfed by the immensity of the sea, to bring us a delicacy that graces tables and tantalizes taste buds worldwide. The ocean can be unforgiving, with rough seas and unpredictable weather, but these fishermen face it all with unwavering determination. Come with me as we delve into the fascinating world of Japanese squid fishing. From the quiet, serene fishing villages where the journey begins, to the bustling fish markets where the freshest catch is sold, every step of the process is a story in itself. The night fishing expeditions where the fishermen prepare their gear under the starlit sky are particularly mesmerizing. The glow of their lanterns on the water, the rhythmic casting of nets, and the anticipation of a good catch create a scene that is both tranquil and thrilling. And then, the journey continues in the hands of skilled chefs who transform these fresh catches into exquisite dishes. Watching a Japanese chef slice squid with precision and care, preparing sushi that is both beautiful and delicious, is a true art form. Each piece of sushi is a culmination of the hard work and dedication of many, from the fishermen to the chefs. Finally, we arrive at the moment of enjoyment. Diners savoring each bite, the flavors dancing on their tongues, the joy and satisfaction evident on their faces. It's a reminder of the incredible journey that brought this delicacy to their plates. So next time you enjoy a piece of squid sushi, remember the story behind it. The ocean, the fishermen, the chefs, and the rich tradition that makes it all possible. The hunt begins. Our journey begins aboard a weathered but sturdy fishing vessel, the salty air thick with anticipation. The crew, their faces etched with years of experience, prepare for the night's expedition. The target? Millions of bioluminescent squid, their pale bodies flashing like underwater fireflies, congregating in the depths. These aren't your average squid. We're talking about Japanese flying squid, known for their delicate flavor and firm texture. And these fishermen? They're masters of their domain, using their knowledge of the sea and specialized equipment to bring in a massive haul. The air crackles with excitement as the captain steers towards the fishing grounds. Let's see what treasures the ocean holds tonight. Squid Heaven, the Japanese Trawl Net Central to this fishing expedition is a marvel of engineering and tradition, the Japanese trawl net. This massive net, hundreds of feet in length, is designed to efficiently catch schools of squid. Imagine a giant underwater scoop, its mouth held open by heavy weights ready to engulf its prey. But it's not just about size, the net is crafted with a specific mesh size, allowing smaller fish to escape while targeting the prized squid. It's a delicate dance between maximizing the catch and ensuring the sustainability of the ocean's resources. This is no ordinary fishing net, it's a testament to generations of ingenuity and respect for the sea. Setting the Trap As the sun dips below the horizon, casting an orange glow across the waves, the crew springs into action. The enormous trawl net is carefully lowered into the water, its descent controlled by a complex system of ropes and pulleys. It disappears into the depths, 
leaving a trail of shimmering bubbles in its wake, the boat slowly motors forward, dragging the net through the water, the anticipation is palpable, will tonight be a bountiful harvest, or a lean night at sea, the answer hidden beneath the waves will be revealed soon enough, the stage is set, the trap laid, now we wait for the squid to make their entrance. Hauling in the bounty. Hours pass. The only sounds are the gentle lapping of waves against the hull, a rhythmic and soothing melody that accompanies the crew's silent vigil. The ocean stretches out endlessly, a vast expanse of blue, with the occasional seabird gliding gracefully overhead, their cries echoing in the stillness, and the distant cries of seabirds. Then, the silence is broken. The winch groans, its gears straining against an immense weight. The sound is a stark contrast to the earlier tranquility, signaling the start of the most crucial, a reminder of the sea's generosity and the hard work required to harvest its riches. A cascade of silver flashes in the moonlight, millions of squid, their tentacles writhing, spill onto the deck. The deck becomes a flurry of activity as the crew works quickly to sort and secure the catch. The squid, with their iridescent bodies and wriggling tentacles, are a mesmerizing sight, a living testament to the ocean's diversity. The air buzzes with excitement and the pungent aroma of the ocean's bounty. The smell is a mix of salt, seaweed, and the unmistakable scent of fresh seafood. It's a scent that speaks of hard work, tradition, and the promise of a bountiful harvest. The crew's spirits are high, their faces lit with smiles and laughter as they celebrate their successful haul. It's a scene of controlled chaos, a testament to the hard work and skill of these fishermen. Each movement is deliberate, each action purposeful. The crew works in harmony, their years of experience evident in their seamless coordination. This is their livelihood, their passion, and their pride. The sea has been generous tonight and the crew's efforts have been rewarded. As the boat heads back to shore, the crew reflects on the night's work, grateful for the bounty they've hauled in and looking forward to the next adventure on the open sea. From ocean to table, the transformation begins. With the deck shimmering under a blanket of squid, the real work begins. The crew wastes no time in sorting and preparing the catch. Speed is essential here, ensuring the squid remain as fresh as possible. Skilled hands work with astonishing speed, their movements a blur as they deftly clean and process the squid. It's a mesmerizing dance of efficiency and precision, a testament to their deep connection to their craft. The air, thick with the smell of salt and sea life, hums with activity. From the depths of the ocean, a culinary treasure is about to be born. Squid, Alchemy, Traditional Preparations Japanese cuisine is renowned for its respect for fresh ingredients and the delicate art of preparation. And squid, with its versatility and unique flavor, holds a special place in the culinary traditions of Japan. From the delicate art of sushi and sashimi to the crispy delight of tempura and the savory depth of dried squid snacks, the possibilities are endless. Each preparation highlights the squid's unique texture and taste, offering a culinary adventure for the senses. Get ready to tantalize your taste buds as we explore the diverse and delicious world of Japanese squid dishes. A Culinary Adventure Exploring Squid Delights Join us as we dive into the fascinating world of squid cuisine, a staple in Japanese culinary traditions. From the bustling fish markets to the serene kitchens of master chefs, squid has found its way into the hearts and plates of many. Let's start with the classics. In the heart of Japan, sushi and sashimi are more than just dishes, they are an art form. The meticulous preparation and the fresh ingredients make these dishes a true delight. Sushi and sashimi showcase the squid's naturally sweet and delicate flavor, either draped over perfectly seasoned rice or served simply with a touch of soy sauce and wasabi. The balance of flavors is key, allowing the squid's unique taste to shine through. The squid's firm, almost crunchy texture provides a delightful contrast to the other ingredients. This texture is achieved through careful selection and preparation, ensuring that each piece is a perfect bite. For those who prefer a bit of crunch, tempura is the way to go. This method of cooking not only adds a crispy layer but also locks in the squid's natural juices, making each bite a burst of flavor. Dipped in a light batter and deep-fried to perfection, the squid emerges golden brown and irresistibly crispy. The batter is key, light enough to not overpower the squid, yet substantial enough to provide that satisfying crunch. Served with a side of dipping sauce, it's a true Japanese comfort food. The dipping sauce, often a blend of soy sauce, mirin, and dashi, complements the tempura perfectly, adding a savory depth to each bite. And let's not forget the savory snacks. In Japan, squid is not just reserved for formal dining, it's a beloved street food as well. Dried squid, seasoned with salt and spices, is a popular treat, perfect with a cold beer. This snack is often enjoyed during festivals and gatherings, bringing people together over its chewy texture and rich flavor. Each bite offers a burst of umami flavor, a testament to the squid's versatility. Whether enjoyed as a snack or a main dish, squid continues to be a cherished ingredient in Japanese cuisine, celebrated for its unique taste and texture. So next time you find yourself in Japan, be sure to explore the many delightful ways squid is prepared and enjoyed. Beyond the Plate Squid in Japanese Culture 
Squid is more than just a source of food in Japan. It's deeply intertwined with the nation's culture and history. It features prominently in traditional art, folklore, and festivals, reflecting its importance in everyday life. In coastal communities, squid fishing is a way of life passed down through generations, connecting families and communities to the sea. Festivals celebrating the squid harvest are a vibrant testament to this enduring bond, showcasing the deep respect and gratitude for the ocean's bounty. It's this deep cultural connection that gives Japanese squid dishes their unique character and significance. Sustainable seafood, ensuring future catches. As with any fishing industry, sustainability is crucial. Japanese fishermen are acutely aware of the need to protect the squid population and the marine ecosystem. They adhere to strict quotas and fishing seasons, ensuring that future generations can continue to enjoy this delicacy. Furthermore, there's a growing movement towards responsible fishing practices, such as using circle hooks to minimize bycatch and promoting the consumption of lesser-known squid species to reduce pressure on overfished populations. By prioritizing sustainability, we can ensure that the tradition of Japanese squid fishing continues to thrive for generations to come. A toast to tradition and taste. So the next time you savor a piece of tender squid sushi or enjoy the crispy satisfaction of perfectly cooked tempura, take a moment to appreciate the journey it took to get to your plate. From the skilled hands of the fishermen to the culinary artistry of Japanese chefs, it's a testament to tradition, sustainability, and the simple joy of delicious food. Kanpai, to the squid, the sea, and the people who bring them together.